guys welcome back to my channel this is Soya from the classy sassy life yes I have rebranded my account and I will give you complete details on why that is going on in my intro video which will be up and live this week today's video is a collab with E. Michelle also known as E. Michelle plans on Instagram I absolutely love her page and I love her YouTube channel if you have not seen her guys you have been sleeping on a great channel so anyway today we are going to be collabing on this beautiful recipe book from the happy planner line we are going to be setting up our planners and showing you guys how we put our recipes in our book in addition to that I also have a video up right now and you can click on this card that's coming up across the screen or you can come back to it after you watch this video on how I created the pictures that I am placing in my recipe book I show you guys how to do that um, two different ways you can either do the square or you can do um, the longer pictures like the um, big happy planner um, size so anyway let's get into this video on how I set up my recipe book this is the recipe book that I picked up from Hobby Lobby I did a quick haul video or I did an insta story on um, the things that I grabbed from there so let's get into it I've already opened it it comes with these grocery list and it's like a meal planner and I'm just going to pop these out because I also have these weekly meal plans so I keep these handy and this will be a good place for those to go as well so they are all together okay so the next thing it has is of course your name page I will be lettering my name on here this some by this summer I'm lettering my names and my name and all my planners I am going to know how to letter by this summer guys Okay, so the first thing it comes with is a common kitchen substitution. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. So let me see if I can zoom in a little bit better. There you go. So it comes with a um, common kitchen substitution. And then it has your family favorites. Then it has your main dishes. Entertaining slow cooker love that that is so cute um, healthy fair scrumptious tasty flavorful nutritious food quick and easy eat good feel good desserts with this beautiful chocolate bun cake and the secret ingredient is one heaping teaspoon of love I love that and then you have miscellaneous love and food is all about the spice that is so cute okay guys so um i had to look at this planner and really figure out what i wanted to do for myself um one of the things that was missing for me was sides so i decided to rearrange some of my dividers so the first divider i'm going to move is the family favorite so i just grabbed all of the pages that go with that and i moved it um and then each one of these come with a colored corner um like I said I opened it before and I started like playing around in it and so this one came with a purple corner but I decided that I didn't want it to be purple I wanted it to be green to go with my main my main dishes so this is a light green color it's not really coming out very well on the um, screen for you guys but that's the light green and then I wanted to use the dark green so they can go together and this came from the healthy fair section right there so anyway I wanted to make sure I used that um, I make sure I move those so they were coordinating and so my family favorites is going to be my sides and with my main dishes okay the next tab that I'm not really going to use is entertaining generally when we're entertaining we are grilling so I'm gonna pop that tab out and I'm gonna grab all of these blue tabs and I'm going to place them behind let's see where do I want to put them I think I'm gonna put all of the blue tabs behind miscellaneous and I know you see that orange tab I'm gonna pull those out and I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with those so now my miscellaneous 
can go back here. I'm not really sure what I'm going to use miscellaneous for, but it's always good to have one, so I'm going to keep those there. All right, so this is orange, just like the slow cooker meals. So I'm going to pop in this orange. And now we have all orange. I use lots of slow cooker meals, especially when school is in and when I'm teaching. It just makes my life easier. So those are the ones. Um, so I needed way more than what was provided. So I just put all of the orange ones together. And then purple is my favorite color. So I used that purple from the Family Favorites and with the um, Healthy Fair tab. Okay. Um, so I hope you guys understood that. So now that I have my planner all set up, I'm going to be adding in a glam girl folder that says, hello gorgeous. And I'm going to put it right here in the front. And when I have, um, obtained my pictures that I want to use, I'm going to place them all in this folder and this is where I'll keep them. If I run into new recipes like in magazines or things like that, I will keep them here until I transfer them into my recipe book. Okay. So now that I have it all set up, now you're going to see me do a little bit of planning in them. Um, if you have not seen my video on how I created my pictures, I uploaded this at the same time as this video, so I hope you were, you're watching this one first. But I have a card up here and a link in the description box to, below to show you guys how you can create your own pictures for your um for your recipe planner using your printer at home if you have a printer that prints on photo paper or you can send it to Walgreens, Walmart or wherever you choose to get your pictures printed. So here's my first entry and it's for honey garlic chicken. It's an orange tab so I know it goes in my in the um, slow cooker section so I'm going to go ahead and pop that over in there. So that is my first one. And as you can see, I used an orange flag, just trying to color coordinate everything and keep it together. So let's go ahead and I'm going to walk you through um, another one and it's going to be a side, okay? So I'm going to use my planner glue pen and I picked this up from Hobby Lobby as well. I think it was like $4 and it was on sale, all the planner stuff. And I'm going to go ahead and just lay my picture right up here at the top on this one okay then I'm going to name it and this is stove top mac and cheese alright so um, I'm using a couple of different pans in here but this is the Signo uh, Uniball pen Signal 307 and I absolutely love this pen. It's one of my favorites. So I'm going to zoom in a little bit guys and you can watch me add this to my um, planner. Okay guys, so what you see me doing is just laying down a checklist and trying to um, color coordinate as much as I can, writing down all of the ingredients for this recipe. I believe it's my mac and cheese recipe. It's my absolute favorite. You should follow me on Pinterest. I will leave a link in the description box below so that you can check out some of the meals that I have there. So after I put the ingredients, I always write down um, the instructions and sometimes I will put things in um, uppercase so that it will stand out for me uh, just because I've made the meal already and if I've made any mistakes or anything turned out bad, I want to make sure that it doesn't happen again. And I try to put spaces in between each of those instructions. Then I put how many it serves and fill in the sidebar. So that's how you um, add this. So either you can put your picture here or as in the slow cooker, I put my picture down here at the bottom. Um, so I'm going to show you one more where you can just put your picture right here into the preparation. So... Okay, put a little glue on it, I'm going to put it in the middle. 
Okay, guys, so this is just another clip of me showing you how you can use your recipe um, planner. You can put your pictures anywhere you want to. It's very versatile that way. And with the video that is linked in a card further back in the video or down in the description box, you can print a 2x3, which is the same size as a box in the Big Happy Planner, or you can print these 2x2 that I created as well and you can put it virtually anywhere on the paper and just write around it um, this is one of my favorite recipes guys and I went ahead and decided to use the back and show you guys that you just flip it over and you keep writing your new recipes um, and the desserts happen to be my specialty because they are my absolute favorites I have a problem with sweets guys yes it's terrible but anyway, um, so right now you're just seeing me lay down um, a sticker because I want to remind myself um, to do something in this recipe. So use your icon stickers as much as possible. I wasn't going to pick up the food sticker book, but now that I have the recipe planner and I see the need for it, I am absolutely going to grab that food um, sticker book so that I can use it in my recipe planner. Um, so that's going to wrap up this video guys. I absolutely loved planning in my recipe planner. Let me know how you use yours. Keep God first in everything you do and plan a classy and sassy life guys. Bye.